In this video, I'll show you how to fix a yellow tint on your screen in Windows 11. If you found this guide useful, then please consider subscribing. And once you've done that, then please consider leaving a like. And let's get right into this. Having a yellow tint on your screen is super annoying, so let's get into some fixes. So I've got a few different ones which we can go and try. Firstly, I just recommend making sure all your cables are properly plugged in. Often a loose cable or something like that is going to go and cause the screen to appear slightly yellow. And something else you can try as well is by using different types of cables. For example, if you're using an HDMI cable between your PC and monitor, you may be able to go and use a DisplayPort cable or whatever other um, outputs and inputs you have, you could try finding a different cable. However, if that still doesn't work, then it's actually something we can try on your computer. And that is what we need to do is firstly go to our display settings. So right click anywhere in your desktop somewhere empty and then go and tap on display settings like this. Wait for it to load. Then what you need to do is just scroll down like so and scroll down until you go and see the option for related settings and go and tap on advanced display. In advanced display, you then need to go and choose the monitor. So if you only have one, then that's not going to apply to you. But if you've got two monitors, then choose the monitor, which has got the yellow tin on. So in this case, I'm going to do it to my uh, display one here. Then what you need to do is go and locate display adapter properties for display one or whatever your display is. Tap here and this is then going to go and open up the properties and I'm going to go and zoom in on this for you guys. And then what you need to do is go to color management at the top and then you need to go and tap on color management again, just like so. And here we are. So then make sure devices is selected. And once again, make sure you've got the correct device selected. It should be go and select use my settings for this device like so. And then what we need to do is go and associate a profile. So go and tap on add in the bottom left like this. And then a profile and the profile I like to use is this one here uh, under ICC profile. So tap on it, then tap OK. And there it is. And then what you need to do is go and tap on close like so. And then you can go and close all of this and try restarting your PC and see if that makes any differences uh, because we've now gone out of this sort of custom profile. If that still hasn't worked, then what you could try is going and making sure you've got your uh, graphics card drivers installed if you have one, for example, Nvidia or AMD. And then what you can do is go and open those up if you've got, say, Nvidia drivers and you can just go and search for them like so, Nvidia. And I can go and open up my control panel like this. I could then go and check the settings out and see if there's anything which may have been set to. For example, come to adjust desktop color settings and just make sure they all look normal and you can also go and adjust it as well if you'd like. But something else which is worth checking out as well is that your actual monitor settings, because a lot of people don't know that, but your own monitor is going to go and have settings as well. So if you use the buttons on your side of the monitor, you could then go and use that and make sure that they're all just set to normal and that it's not on some weird mode or something like that. I hope you guys did find this useful. If you did, please go down below and consider leaving a like. Peace.